This story is brought to us from CNN. From CNN, we get this one out of Mississippi. Now, remember I did an editorial not too long ago about a police officer that shot into a home and shot an 11-year-old. Remember that one? Well, the Board of Aldermen of a Mississippi town have voted nearly unanimously to reinstate the police officer who shot the 11-year-old boy inside his own home earlier this year. On May 20th of this year, Sergeant Greg Capers mistakenly shot in the chest and seriously injured Adarian Murray. That was the young kid. Remember, I did the editorial line. While he was responding to a domestic disturbance call at the child's home, according to his mother, Nicola Murray, and the Mississippi Bureau of Investigation. That's what happened. Now, Capers was initially put on administrative leave while the shooting was investigated. CNN reported at the time, and Capers was then suspended without pay in June after a four to one vote by the Indianola Board of Aldermen. Now, just recently this month, the Board of Aldermen voted four to one to reinstate Capers during a special session. His reinstatement is effective immediately, according to Michael Carr, an attorney, an attorney with the Police Benevolent Association. You know what the Police Benevolent Association is, right? Huh? Police what? Union! Thank God for police unions, right? Or cops would be out of their, out of their job. Now, Carr, who's the attorney with the Police Benevolent Association, told CNN in a statement, uh, Capers is glad for the reinstatement, ready to get back to work. Yeah, I bet he is. Since the determination was made yesterday evening, we are yet to know when he will be uh, put back on schedule or what shift. He does remain a sergeant. <laughs> Gets to keep his stripes. Exclusive video from the meeting shared with CNN by Murray family attorney Carlos Moore shows 11-year-old Adarian Murray and his family attending the Board of Aldermen meeting. In the brief video, Adarian appears overwhelmed with emotion and can be sobbing as he is led as he is led from the room after the vote to reinstate Capers. <laughs> That's 11-year-old Adarian Murray sobbing and a town in disagreement and disbelief. It's not right, it's not fair. With a vote of four to one, the Indianola Board of Aldermen allowed Sergeant Greg Capers to rejoin the Indianola Police Department. So, and it goes down a little farther. You could uh, read it in the link below. But the thing is, you know, here's the bottom line. Cop responds to a domestic violence thing, uh, call, cop shoots into the home, cop hits 11-year-old boy. Cop gets suspended during the investigation. Cop gets it reinstated. Little boy freaks out because he's scared. Oh my God, this cop is coming back for me. Or something, right? I don't know. But something caused that kid to burst out sobbing. Yeah, and 11-year-old Darian Murray, he was in that meeting when the vote happened. And he didn't take it very well. His anxiety actually got so high that he had to be rushed to the hospital. After the cop was reinstated. And guess what? A lot of us are sobbing with you. 